Hi guys, my name is Narayan Baghel and I welcome all of you in this video. And uh, in this video, we are going to learn about how to configure uh, audit policy in Active Directory uh, Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 uh, for administrator, IT administrator, or server administrator. Administrator, it is always good to have uh, the knowledge of uh, this thing, how to configure auditing, because it helps to track the activities which is happening uh, in the domain. Uh, so I will tell you how to configure this thing. It is a very small configuration, a small setting. So let me uh, begin with uh, this configuration. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to create one group policy object. So let me go to group policy management console first. And uh, I am here group policy management console and here we have to create one group policy object I have cre already created multiple created multiple uh, group policy object objects for my different different videos so I uh, will create fresh uh, group policy object here let me put uh, one file or uh, this thing file server auditing and uh, I created this uh, templates now and uh, um, I need to create one OU here so I'm going to active directory users and computers option and uh, here I will create so here uh, we will create one OU I'm creating uh, I'm giving name uh, this thing I'm going to my uh, server and creating one OU organizational OU unit sorry and I'm giving uh, this thing uh, name to this group uh, something like uh, whatever you want you can give here not an issue it is your choice and uh, I'm putting server and uh, servers I gave name and hitting OK and once again I'm creating one more OU inside this and giving name uh, this thing file so I have done it and OK now what we need to do is I have created one uh, group policy object this side uh, I will show you this thing file server auditing so I'm just now uh, um, I will link this group policy object with uh, recently created uh, OU here yeah, so I just need to go back once again group policy management and now that uh, server OU is reflecting file uh, OU is reflecting here so just I'm um, clicking here and uh, this one file server auditing so I have created uh, linked this uh, file here and what uh, we need to do now we will uh, first of all let me remove this as of now and I will edit this uh, uh, file server uh, auditing uh, uh, group policy object here so so that we can configure a few policies here so I mean now uh, I, I inside this group policy management editor and now I will go to uh, computer configuration and uh, uh, this thing Windows setting and here I will go to uh, next thing is uh, what uh, is required windows setting security setting and uh, next policy there will be policy option local policy so now I am inside local policy I have opened and here we have a option audit policies so uh, let me click on this and uh, I will expand it so we have this much of uh, lo uh, this local policies here so we can track all those things uh, now what I'm going to do is here I'm just uh, uh, clicking uh, audit uh, this thing object access so we have this option here I'm just double clicking on this and uh, selecting define these policies so we have two option uh, one is success and one is failure so I'm just uh, clicking uh, in failure option and ok and uh, it is closed now what we need to do is we need to uh, link this uh, group policy object with uh, we have uh, we created one uh, 
OU so let me close this or let me go once again I just I should also uh, confirm once uh, audit policy and yes it is done so I will close all those things and now I will link with it is already linked here so let me delete once from here and uh, re link it uh, so now it is applied mm, this uh, policy and uh, if we have any user in this uh, uh, OU inside this group in, inside this OU we, if we have any user or any user of any uh, group and he is trying to log in uh, in this uh, server or he is not able to uh, uh, log in or by uh, by mistake is uh, is putting wrong password or username and he is not getting authenticated with the server so we can track this uh, 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 this activity through this uh, setting so in this we uh, learned how to uh, apply uh, this thing audit policy in active directory uh, server uh, windows server 2016 and uh, this is what uh, uh, we can do and uh, I will ask you to uh, follow the same procedure and uh, learn how to do it and I would uh, request you to please uh, watch this video and learn this configuration from here and uh, request you to like this video and share this video and don't forget to subscribe you can subscribe my channel in YouTube my channel name is server 2016 uh, tp4 active directory if you will hit this I, you will get my channel and you can get more videos in that and I would like to say thanks for watching this video